Sancho and today I'm bringing you MOA, MOA, B Friday, what? MOA B Fridays episode number 36. I'm going to be using the AK-47 and the super spectacular golden camouflage. Again. <laughs> Today I'm coming with you MLAB Fridays episode number 36. Today I'm going to be using AK-47 and the super sexy golden camouflage. So I'm going to be using the silencer and the extended mags attachments. So if you guys didn't know, broke tattoos, broke cookies, um, the specialist strike bonus, if you achieve the specialist bonus, you will receive all the proficiencies in the game except for the two attachments and the damage on the shotguns. So that's why I use my the when I'm trying to get the MYBs, that's why I use the two attachments on my gun or I damage my shotguns. But you guys know the whole spiel on my videos. I get 25 kills with the gun and 24 with hardline. Um I know you guys don't care about this. So normally I don't do this, but I'm gonna be giving you guys pro tips on how to get MOAB and MOA on um, MOAB on downturn. So okay. So tips are stay on the outskirts, okay? So I really recommend that. I know what you guys are thinking, Nacho. Put you pussy, come on, like can't be in the outskirts like a dog. Hold on, Nacho Nason. So you guys know me. You guys know I have more of a defensive play style. Okay, so nonetheless. The reason why I stress to, to stay on the outskirts of the map is because there's a lot of action going on in the middle. Now I know what you're thinking, Nacho, isn't, isn't action a good thing? Yes, yes it is. But in this game, it does get so hectic. So I recommend you stay out of the action because if, let's say for example, you're going to um, flag B, there's going to be a lot of head glitching in this game. There is. So when you're in flag B, it tends to show up more. So you're, you're just asking to get killed. So you don't want that. So I recommend you go off on the map, um, towards the middle, off the side, in the buildings. And you stay there and don't stay in one spot actually. Um, when you're killing people in one spot, they will come back to revenge kill you. So you want to keep it moving, go from building to building, don't stay in the same place, play it safe you guys. Um, you have to play smart. So keep on edge and enough with the pro tips you guys. I don't know if you guys have watched my Triple Tuesday video. If you haven't, there's a link in the annotation somewhere above on top of my video somewhere. Click it, watch it, or watch it now, later, whenever you want not donation. I don't really care. But I talked about going back to school in that video. And if you guys watched it, you know that I'm a senior in high school. This is my last year. And I've been in summer. And I, I talked about how I wasn't sure if I was going to keep up with the, if I was going to be able to keep up with the pace I had over the summer. So hopefully I can. I, you know I love making videos for you guys. It is a passion of mine. And yeah, so I just had my first week of high school. And let me tell you guys how it went. So I get to school and there's the freshmen, the sophomores, the juniors, the seniors. So the freshmen of course, they're kind of like lost, like whoa this is high school, how yeah amazing, cool, whatever. And then the sophomores are kind of like okay, getting the feel of this, I'm getting it. Juniors are like, I was like okay we're almost there, we're almost there, we're just like this is getting exciting now. And then seniors were kind of like okay same shit different day like we're excited for senior year but come on it's like keep it moving so yeah so then we get there see all our friends how exciting right um so we get to home that's the first class we had of the day and um okay so we get our schedules i look at my schedule and what do i see classes i didn't ask for what is this i don't know so like one of the classes i got was uh AP Music Theory. Okay, so I did not ask for this class at all. I wanted a different class. They gave me AP Music Theory. I know shit about music. So I go into that class. I went into it a couple of days ago. And that was my first time. And I go in there and I'm like, crap, all these people are like 
look like music geniuses. Not really, but you get me more than compared to me. So I go in there and then I'm like, okay, this is pretty cool, pretty cool. It's not bad, maybe, maybe there's a chance. But then as the class progresses, you start talking about notes and like flat and all this stuff. Like you just and then like at the end of the class, he wanted us to write down notes. Go up on the board and write down whatever note it was after G, B, you know, stuff like that. And then you're kind of like staring at him, the teacher like, I don't know anything. What am I supposed to do? Because he wanted everyone to go up. And some of us don't know why we were in there. So kind of just take that out. But I, am get, I did get my classes switched. So it's better now. But yeah, that was one of the classes I really did not want. And another class I had caught in that I didn't ask for was sociology. I guess sociology, I was like, okay, I, I know what what it is, but I'm not exactly sure. So I'm like, I don't know what to expect. So I go in there and I asked originally for AP Psychology. So I'm guessing that's why they gave me sociology because AP Psychology was taken. So, not taken, it was full. So they gave me sociology and took on the class. So the first semester is sociology and the second semester is psychology. So I think, I'm not, I'm not sure how I feel about that class. It's, it seems interesting. It's, it seems good, but I do want to keep AP psychology. And so, you know, at my high school, they did this thing where they used to have honors and regular. So they took out both, like the separation. And so now they're just, everyone's mixed together. We're all the same, we're all the separation. And you know, I get why they took it off because the classes are similar. Honest, you don't really do much. You kind of are expected a little bit more, but not really. So they took that out and then now we're all together. So when you go into your classes, you're not really used. I'm an honor student, AP honors. I, I'm usually, I like to take the, classes are a little bit higher because it is it's more of a it's not challenging but it's more you challenge yourself a little bit more than the regular it looks good for college okay and so you go into the class and you sit down and then you look around and what do you see people that have, like they're stupid like, what, are they, what are they doing here like you don't you don't know what the hell they're doing there like you if you're sitting in English class, sitting next to like an idiot that you've known your whole life, and you're like, you're cool, but can you write an essay? I I don't know. Like I don't. I, that's the only thing I don't like. That it's all the same. So you're mixing with people who want to learn, who want to get their education, want to move on to college, have goals, they have it all set out, and then people who are just kind of there, just for the high school diploma those who don't really know what's what's happening they're just there talking then class away and you're kind of distracted by these people and what can you do nothing because they felt we had an undeserving advantage over the regular students so yeah um but other than that i think it was a pretty good first senior year first week of senior year but I'm very excited. This year we're going to have prom, grad night, homecoming, all the football games. It's all going to be really fun. And yeah, so I'll keep you guys tuned on that. And okay. But anyways, guys, that's my video. I hope you enjoyed it. But as always, my name is Papa Nacho, the father of the Nacho Nation. If you like the video, be sure to leave a like rating. I appreciate it very much. Share your video uh, with your friends on Twitter, Facebook, Google+, Plus, whatever shoes you have. So, but nonetheless, thanks for watching, guys. I, if you stumbled across my video, please be sure to subscribe and join the Nacho Nation. We are full of soft bosses here. Other than that, I want you guys. Peace out, Nacho Nation.